Hey, you guys, on this thankful Thursday, um, coming to give um, some encouragement. This is like a two part word. Um, bear with me, guys, because I am tired. Um, God has started giving me downloads since 5 19 this morning. Um, and it's crazy because I was just talking to y'all on Tuesday about my fire alarms and how they keep sporadically going off. Well, the maintenance man came and replaced all my fire alarms. So my fire alarms are brand new and they are still periodically going off. So I know it's God speaking. I know it's God talking. Um, because um, whenever they kept going off, um, he told me to write down what time. Um, the time that they were going off and he told me to look up the numbers in the strong concordance. So, um, like I said, it happens four times. So, and they all tie together and it's like a two part word, but it's all going to tie in together. Um, the first time my alarm went off this morning was, like I said, was at 519. Um, the first time I really didn't think anything of it cause I was having a prophetic dream. So I, um, went back to sleep. Um, and then it, that's when it happened. It, my alarm went off again. My fire alarm went off again. But 519 in the strong concordance means, means to um, strangle um, in order to put away or to kill, to hang oneself to the end, to end one's life by hanging. Um, this is referring to your enemies. Um, the scripture for this... Um, for this number in the strong concordance you guys for 519 is matthew 27 verse 5 and he cast down the pieces of silver in the temple and departed and went and hung himself this is talking about judas how judas betrayed um jesus your enemies are basically betraying themselves because um the way they're coming against you they're not really coming against you they're coming against the god that you serve i have mentioned this in the video before and when they're doing that it's like they're hanging themselves they're dooming themselves um god is a scripture that i always quote god bless those that bless me and curse those that curse me and david um always said well in the book of psalms he was saying god um fight against those who fight against me war against those who war against me so god is warring on your behalf um in this hour when it comes to your enemies um whenever i had went back to sleep i went into a prophetic dream and i saw in a prophetic dream where um your where our enemies are like turning on themselves they're like telling on themselves um trying to like basically like snitch on each other about what they've been doing in the spiritual realm what kind of witchcraft and stuff they've been doing and who've been doing it um because basically the warfare you guys that y'all have been experiencing is has been sent by witches and warlocks um that's what god had revealed to me in that dream and then he woke me back up again um at 5 30 5 30 in the strong concordance means um once one time or once and for all so this time god is going to deal with your enemies once and for all he is sick of it he is tired of it um he knows that we're getting frustrated when it comes to our enemies bothering us he knows we are getting tired um of it because it's just like you're trying to do the work of god you're trying to do the will of god and you're st steadily being attacked and he's getting tired of it because some of these people he has done warn um to leave you alone he has done told them several times to leave you alone to go about their way okay um fell back to sleep again um when i woke back up again my alarm went off at 6 15 now this is the second part um we are like i said we are in the season of 57 83 the year 57 83 so we're about to see judgment and we're about to see blessings okay so the reason why the enemy is attacking you so much it makes sense because you're about to birth something you're about to produce something and that's what um number six 16 means in the strong concordance um you're about to give birth produce to bring something forth from the womb so you're trying you're giving birth to something in the season you're giving birth to whatever god is telling you to do in the season um so don't give up endure also um keep fighting god kept showing me yesterday um number the number 119 i kept seeing it over and over again and that means to fight so keep fighting okay do not give up um because again god is going to really deal with your enemies 
Um, I fell back asleep. The last no, the last time my alarm went off was at 6.31. 6.31 in a strong quarter is means to wipe off, to wipe oneself, to, um, oneself, to wipe of for oneself, okay? Um, so, like I said, God is really about to deal with y'all enemies. He's about to um, wipe some of y'all enemies away. Um, and then he's also is going to do something else. Let me go to the next number. The, and then I said, like I said, it happened. It happened four times, okay? So, four means to um, be light without weight not heavy not burdensome some of these spiritual attacks have been a burden to us has been hard for us to endure and try to embrace it has got to the point where some of us felt like giving up but when god deals with it he's going to wipe it away so we will no longer be burdened we will no longer be heavy we will be um light without weight because it is hard dealing with spiritual warfare especially when it's back to back to back to back to back and you can feel the attacks you can of the enemy and you can feel the attempts it gets frustration at times because it's like god like when are my enemies gonna leave me alone god in your word you said that when a man waits pleases god his enemies are made to be at peace with him but you know like i said some of these people are very very demonic so they're actually sending out witchcrafts they're actually sending out spells and all that other stuff that is not of god um they're sending to um trying to really take you out um, pretty much or to slow you down and cause you to be delayed but God is about to wipe all that stuff away he's about to deal with them and a lot of us you guys um, you know have been crying about it whenever I looked at the number 4 I came across God showed me the number 1144 which means a tear and God is about to really wipe your tears away um, because like earlier this week I was crying um, I was crying tears of joy and I was crying tears of sorrow because I know what's about to come. I, I, I know the blessings that God is about to bestow upon his people. God has allowed me to see that last night in a prophetic dream. But I also know the judgment that's about to come. And this judgment that's about to come or has already started because we're in the month of Adar. It's not going to be pretty. And my prayer was, you know, I was praying before that God will use this to help save some people to help them turn from their wicked ways some of them are going to be saved but some of them are reprobates like i said they had before um one time in the video they had them made up their mind what master they're going to serve and that is the devil um and the scripture for that for um, number 1144 is revelations 21 and 4 and god shall wipe away all tears from their eyes and there shall be no more death neither sorrow no crying neither shall there be any no any more pain for the former things are passed away um that's the scripture that he told me um to read for this one okay and then i'm gonna read i'm i'm read i'm i'm, I'm led to read this other scripture hebrew 12 chapter 12 verse 17 for ye know how that afterward when we have inherited the blessings he was rejected for he had found no place of repentance though he saw it carefully with tears okay so i just want to come guys and share that um because like i said we have been going through a lot and it's it's warfare just hang in there um God wants you to keep fighting. He don't want you to give up. God is really about to deal with your enemies. Um, he has already dispatched his Psalm 91 angels um, to war on our behalf. I know I told y'all before that he was going to. He has already did it. Um, he had let me know that, showed me that last night too, that he has already sent his angels out to fight and war for us. Um, so there really is a war um, going on in the spiritual realm when it comes to God's children, when it comes to his chosen ones. Um, so just stay encouraged continue to fight um continue to fast if you're fasting and i love you guys um i pray that this has helped you and bless you on today and forgive you guys because i am tired like i said i went to bed at like two o'clock this morning and i got back up at like 5 19 and i was trying to go to sleep and god was just like no get up and write these numbers down so that's what i did and um so i can deliver this message today that he wants me to deliver um, for a time such as this so i love you guys have a thankful thursday 
Um, God is going to deal with your enemies. Um, and the reason why the attacks are so bad is because you're about to give birth to something. Um, but God is going to deal with them. And your enemies are going to come to the seats real, real soon. So stay prayful, stay mindful during this time. And I love you guys. And I will chat with you all later.